We're told that voter ID laws are meant to protect the integrity of elections. We are told that voter ID laws are meant to protect the integrity of elections. From 2000 through 2014, in general, primary, special, municipal, dog catcher races, you name it, there were 31 voter fraud cases out of one billion ballots cast. That is zero, well, I'm sorry, point zero, 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 three, one. Let that number marinate. Zero, 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 three, one. I mean, think about it. We are filing, and I, I want to say it's the fourth in a succession of four bills, and litigating probably our seventh and eighth case, and spending more and more money because of point zero 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 three one. We are making it harder for people to vote. Why? This body, and I say this body, and I'm talking over the years, has made it a tradition, and not a very good one, of making it harder for people to vote. Why? Why? And so I ask each and every one of you as we go forward, and we're going to have to make a vote on this one, and it's a tough vote. I'm not saying it's not. It is. Depending on where you sit in this chamber, it's a tough vote. Think about why. And that's what I ask of each and every one of you as you consider this, because we're in for a long, hot summer of having to defend this again in the courts. And guess what? We're going to lose again. Thank you, members.